<coughs> Hello everybody and welcome to another video. Today it's the what, 6th, 6th, 6th of February and uh, the upstairs has been totally gutted and uh, the everything is gone. And it, We are in the process of waiting for the structural engineer to get back to us to find out whether we can get these um, ceiling joists uh, raised or removed or take one out of two or two out of three. We don't know yet. Uh, we've got various um, options available. We'd like to um, have the ceiling completely open, but. This is uh, something we still need to wait on. We've begun torching the floor, which will be basically help us to finish the floor with the um, desired color, which would be the vintage uh, style uh, floor, which I'll show you how it looks like. Uh, this is the sample that we'd like to achieve with the wood. On the floor so basically you basically burn it with the torch which just go here this thing here which is basically used you could use that for doing roofs like felt and things fire extinguisher just in case and basically you basically singe it to a crisp like that and then you brush it and then you get that nice finish that has been varnished once, so you get, and the grain raises as well, but you can't really see it very well, but the grain is raised, so you basically, the grain is staying dark, but the rest is getting quite nice, so that's going to be the spectacular floor we are going to have on the, on this level, so, it was a bit iffy when we started, we didn't know whether we were going to play burn the whole house but no it's turning out to be quite nice and basically what's um next is um we are having this is insulation we've already used the insulation that was on above the um, ceiling joist and we just stuck it at the back here and then we're gonna have pir which is the hard um insulation which is something that looks a bit like this uh 50 millimeter which is five centimeter thick which will be covering this whole area and that also uh, will have wood insulation 100 mil wool insulation into that 120 mil cavity and then on top of that to cover the rafters uh, we'll have the 50 millimeter uh, pir again the same stuff completely um, covering the whole ceiling uh, for maximum insulation and uh, we'll have some radiators um, we we have decided it's it's a difficult decision to make to to decide. It depends how well insulated the place will be. If the well the place is well insulated and we don't need to put a lot of heat, the calculator says that we need you know certain number of radiator. But what we're going to do? We're going to have some cavity here, um, you know, in front of the insulation, and we've already got some pipes for the central heating. There's one here. There's one here, and this will be basically. We'll just basically put a radiator and then another one, and then if we need more radiator, we will just add to it. But because they'll be behind the radiator cover, we won't really be seeing it, and the rest of the area will be basically storage for some uh, shoes or other things like this. Okay, so I've got my hard hat. So I hope uh, you've enjoyed my video and uh, we'll see what the result is going to be in the next couple of weeks, I guess. Uh, we're making good progress. Bye.